Hi you guys, this is Shantae here, and I'm here to share with you um, another mini album that I have completed um, for this month, my swap on Your Paper Pantry. And um, I use the Tim Coffee Cottage, cotton, cotton, what is that? Goodness. Cottage Garden Collection, the warm version. And um, this is the front cover. And um, it just says, um, Nature, Share the Beauty. And I used a um, dollar stamp I got my friend to send me. And I used about, cut it in half and used the bottom portion. Um, Share the Beauty. So, um, because the background was so busy, I just, um, you know, left it plain. So that's the front cover. First page. Um, this is my first page. Let me make sure you can see. Okay, that's, that's good. Okay, so that's this first page. Just did a little pocket. I did another one of those little, um, you know, matted for six photos. So that's that one. And it just does like an accordion. Tucks in. Okay. This is the second page. Right there. Prima die cut where she can stick a picture. Um, a picture can go um, up under there. Right there. Third page um, is right here. I just did a little um, thing. Uh, Tamika did this in my mini. I just did that. And stuck a um, photo mat and a journaling spot on this side. Because I love this red. I just love it. So, um, that's that page. And the next page over here, I love the red again so much until I just couldn't cover it up. So, I just outlined the, um, the biggest flower. You see that? In my Viva Decor pen. My Viva glitter pen, and um, just put a string of bling down the side. So if she want to put a photo, whatever that she can. But I just love the way that turned out. Now this is the next page, and um, uh, I put these. I, I tried to use um uh, these magnets, and I'm gonna tell you something. I have never experienced. I have never. Experience anything that say a magnet and they don't even stick together. I mean, what this is just ridiculous. So because my room is in disarray, I got everything everywhere because I'm redoing my room. I cannot find my uh, Velcro or any of my other stuff. But before I put this in the mail, I will fix this. But this is just for the video. So this is um, look at that, and it's just humongous. So this um, that page, and if the magnets work, it would. Close like that. And I used the die cut from the collection and um, just kept the paper on one half side so it wouldn't stick. And then on top and then behind, I just made um, a little um, thing for journaling or picture, another photo if she like. And it just tucks back in. Right up on it, I'll fix it later. Just tucks in. This is the next page. Um, next page, I just. Um, Made the photo photo page and then put the die cut at the top and want to scrap bling around. I just I love the way that page turned out. That's that page. All right, the next page. Um, Tamika did a tutorial on how to do this on this page, and so I just made a trap of uh, a pop the uh, pulled out. And because in any of the collection pages and collection will work with this, I just did three. Normally I would have changed one of the panels out, but I just left it like this and just put a ribbon and a trim to break all this the one pattern up. Um on this. I still like the way it turned out, but like I said, I couldn't find any other paper that would work for what the look I was going for. So that's that that's um that one. I like the way that turned out. Um, this is the next page. Die cut with the 
um, mat and everything on it. I like that. Next page, um, again, another one of those uh, pockets that Tamika did a tutorial on. And I just put a die cut strip on the side. And I'm not real sure whether or not I like this page or not. I'm going to think about it and see. I may change it. I'm not real sure um, because I wanted to tie the two pages in. And even if I went after I went and distressed the edges, it still is a little bit too bright for me. So, I don't know. But anyway, um, same thing. Ugly magnets that do not work. Okay? Do not buy those magnets from two, uh, High Block for $2.99 the roll. It don't work. The one, unless I have a defective roll. I'll put it like that. Mine does not work. And then I bought some more magnets from Walmart. They don't work. So, I don't know. Maybe I'm just full of magnet power to make it die or something. I don't know. But anyway, this is this page. I actually like the way that turned out. Yep, and so it just folds like that with a die cut. That's that page. Okay, the next page is um, I just use a border down this side and a border right here and a photo mat. And of course, she can. Uh, uh, I didn't glue this down. I just glued the ends, and then I didn't glue this down. So she can um, just stick a photo on there and um, take the rest of the adhesive out if she would like. But I left it for a photo. So that's that page. Alright, and so the next page is this page. Um, same concept. Die cuts. Want to scrap again. <laughs> Love the blame. And um, that's that page. Right there. Okay, and then the next page is uh, the envelope thing. I did a, a tutorial on. Uh, tutorial on earlier and it just flips like so and the pullouts are on the side and I just put three little blings at the bottom because um, this takes up the whole room the whole basically the whole room on that so that's that page and it has to be a total of eight pages on um, six side and two covers so it's eight pages this is the next page and um, I hope you don't hear my phone ring in the background. Uh, that's that page right here. And then um, it just do put, I just did photo mats, journaling or whatever. And um, they just slide back in like so. And this is the last page. And on this page, I used my um, new Elegant Edges cartridge that I got. Um, um, my other friend to uh, find this in me, and she did. And so um, on this page, I did I did the same thing. Um, I did the photo mat, and I glittered the butter, the little bird. I meant to say, <laughs> glittered the bird with um, my speaker pants, orange speaker pants, and then um, I didn't glue this down, so a photo can slide up on there, and she could just mat it that way. And um, so that's the end of uh, my mini. And I hope you guys like it. I hope she likes it above all. And then this is the back cover, of course. Same as the front. That's the back cover. And, um, yeah. So I hope she likes um, her mini. And, oh, yeah, one more thing. Uh, I'm uh, on a little scrap, scrap of heavy name site. We had to, um, I joined, it's like a paper swap where you, um, like, uh, you have to send like 30 sheets of, of paper, uh, like what your partner likes and decorate a, a pizza box and, and send, put it in, in the pizza box. This is my little box and I'm going to tell you, this box is ridiculous. I could not follow her directions. It's like a, it's like a, a piece of box with an overhang. But this is it, and then um, inside, I'm not, I'm too, I'm not even gonna show you the other part of it. Just ridiculous. This is, this is what the paper that's gonna go in the inside. Seven, I just put it on um, rubber band so I won't get it confused. Seven Gypsy Savannah Collection because she likes that. Seven Gypsy, Gypsy Market Collection, and then Seven Gypsy 
Victoria collection. And I love all these papers. And um, this is what she said she liked. So that's what she's going to get. And I used the Wild Saffron, Saffron, how you pronounce it, paper stack and the embellishments and a little scrap, uh, want to scrap bling to decorate the top. Alright, so you guys have a good day. Um, it's real early here. That's why I'm stumbling over all of my words. I didn't have, um, I don't, I hadn't had my pick me up this morning so I'm just all over the place um but y'all have a good day and um yeah make it good all right bye